I mean, you literally tried to kill everyone on Earth. You know what? <laughs> you. Hey guys, it's Wanda One here, and today I'm gonna be talking about the most toughest, determined, and prideful character in all of anime. That's right, you've guessed it, this character is none other than Vegeta, the Prince of All Saiyan. So with Prince Vegeta being the topic of this video, let's talk about how he is one of the biggest frauds in the DBZ franchise. That's right, I've said it, Vegeta is one of the biggest frauds in Dragon Ball Z. So Vegeta fanboys, strap in, because I'll be clowning on Vegeta this entire video. Oh, and before I get into the video, I should tell y'all that this video is really only for comedic purposes. So to all y'all about to flame me in the comments, calm down. Grab a snack, a drink, sit down, and enjoy the video. All right, the first fraudulent moment I want to talk about y'all with Vegeta is when this man gets cooked by the very organism that killed off his entire species. Now, during this arc, I'm not gonna lie, Vegeta was cooking. He was going against some randoms we didn't know about, but you know, he cooked against them. He got his wins. Okay, I was like, oh yeah, his aura was at an all-time high. But all of a sudden, he encounters Frieza. And you know, he's talking mad crazy to Frieza, talking about how he's the legendary Super Saiyan and all this yada yada yada. But then, he just gets absolutely cooked by Frieza. I mean, I'm Imagine getting cooked by a racist that she was talking mad crazy to. But now all of a sudden we have Vegeta over here trauma dumping to Goku. Kakarot, listen to me closely, Kakarot. That man you see before you is truly evil. So could you hurry up? I have to meet a shoddy over at Planet Garbin Sector 9. He's forced the Saiyans to work for him for so long. Your father and even my father were even killed after he blew up my home planet. Well, that's cool and all, Vegeta, but considering your track record- Forget about me and focus on him! We worked so hard for him, he also took our Saiyan shotties. One of them being my own mother. I've shot you through the heart, how are you even still alive? I've suffered under this evil freak. <coughs> Please, Kakarot. <coughs> Do it for your Saiyan pride. I mean, you literally tried to kill everyone on Earth. You know what, f*** you. <laughs> Finally! Alright, so up next is when this man Vegeta gets absolutely we, we, waxed by Android we. 18. So Vegeta coming off a huge win with him playing Android 19 and surprising everyone with him now becoming a Super Saiyan. So Vegeta being the person he is, encounters Android 18. And this man is straight up cocky from the get-go. And I mean, that W to his hand got him way too gassed up, but it don't matter because Android 18 by the humble bro, peep this. So at the beginning with this fight, Android 18 decides to get the first lick on Vegeta. But Vegeta says, hell not. Nah. So he hits her with the classic headbutt and absolutely hits the pro out of her, then immediately hits her with that key blast. Then it pans over to the sea fighters, and they're absolutely shocked that Vegeta is giving 18 the works, especially Krillin. And we all know why Krillin is shocked because he don't want his girl to go, <laughs> man. You know, you feel me? Hey, hey Krillin, it's all right. You can say it, man. You can say it. But they don't know what's about to come next. Trust. Moving forward, we come to realize that Vegeta's key blast did absolutely zero damage. So Vegeta gets right back to throwing them things with 18, but it don't seem like she phased at all. Now, let this be a lesson to y'all. If you're trying your absolute hardest against someone and they're blocking all your punches with ease, go hit that Joe Star technique and get to dip it. But as you can see here, Vegeta does not care and he continues to waste his energy and throw punches with no prevail. But then it gets to that moment, the moment that will forever change Vegeta's life. And to this day, Vegeta has yet to recover from this moment. Vegeta realizes that Android 18 has been toying with him this whole time. Better scramble like an egg before you get folded like an omelet, nigga. Hey. Cause now this man will hold on to his left arm like how Mariah Mills is holding on to Zion. Anyways, this is the end for part one of this video. I really hope y'all enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. I hope y'all stay safe. God bless and I'll see y'all guys later.